This week, we've seen temperatures hit triple digits and have been on your side with how to safely enjoy the outdoors while also being aware of what heat related illnesses look like. For those that don't have a place that they can call home, being in the heat is inevitable. Our Taylor Martin joining me live in the studio this morning on how some local organizations are coming together to give people a place to go at all times of the day. Taylor. Well, the Salvation Army Center of Hope is seeing an increase in people coming through their doors. They serve as the only overnight family shelter in the area. Leaders with the Salvation Army say they're seeing more and more families come through their door and without your support, they can't serve them. They say while they see an increase in clients over the summer, they see a decrease in donations. They offer food, clothes, casework, job skills training, and a place for people to rest their heads at night. To get it all done with the rising temperatures, the Center of Hope is partnering with a day shelter called the Love Center. Their idea was to take if we provide the basic needs for you to be a productive citizen, um, then we can take and help you with your mindset that will keep you productive and get you back in society. Now, both the Center of Hope and Love Center say they are always in need of donations, whether it's monetary to support their services and keep their lights on, or things like food, water, and hygiene products. Now, both the Center of Hope and Love Center say that, you know, they could always use donations, whether it's monetary to support their services and also keep their lights on for things like food, water and hygiene. All right, thank you a lot for that, Taylor. Live in our studio, again, also relying heavily on volunteers. So we have more ways that you can help on our website.